Hey guys, Jason Eichler here for Daft Star, and today we are joined by Diamonds Under Fire. We have Vanessa, Melinda, and Jessica. Thanks for coming in, guys. Thank you for having us. Now, Little Birdie told me you guys are back in the studio mixing your next album. How's the sound going to differ from the Hearts on Hiatus EP? Well, the Hearts on Hiatus EP is uh, an EP of remixes and old demos, so it was kind of just like a collective of some old stuff um, kind of made new to give our friends, fans, and people um, some music to kind of hold them over in between records. Um, as far as the new EP, um, these girls collaborated with me, um, which wasn't on the last record. Um, so it's a kind of a new development of the band. And uh, it'll be Diamonds Under Fire, but way more creative since you know, collaborating with other people. And um, I think we kind of explored like just different territories. And okay. uh, we mixed up a lot of different styles and genre influences, you know, and these girls put their stamp on it and, you know, kind of made the new creation of the band. Okay, and what's the new songwriting process like? And you guys can answer this too. Um, I mean, as far as music goes, um, it's a collaboration. I write the lyrics and melody, but um, if you guys want to go into that more as far as like in the rehearsal room or studio, like what we kind of Yeah, do. I mean, we'd, um, on the last EP, the songwriting process was really collaborative. Usually Vanessa will come in with, um, you know, like a chord progression and then we just like mess around and mess around with different bass parts, just with different drum parts. Care to elaborate? <laughs> just do it. Just give us a beat. <laughs> Jess, Jess plays drum beats and I play bass. And um, yeah. Perfect. Yeah. And you guys get when you're in your live performance, you get a little angry up there. What's the inspiration when you just like go ape shit on your drum set? <laughs> you can give this to yeah. yeah. I don't know. I just don't think there's any other way to be for me behind the drums. It's just like the way that I am with it. Really, yeah. And you guys just went to Nam. What was that like? Are there any highlights from that weekend? I love Nam. I I love gear and I love technology and the innovative companies that are coming up with like new recording techniques or microphones and <clears throat> like you know we work with uh, you know Dunlop and Ernie Ball and Invader and, and um, it's just really. Ex like exciting to connect with those people and other artists and musicians who are all there and it's you know fun there's like crazy people dressed up that's exciting you know who get into it and it's just fun and yeah. you guys just played the viper room do you have any other upcoming <laughs> shows or performances yeah we have um a show on february 22nd with uh it's called electro pr music and arts festival okay. and that's a charity show uh, so mark your calendars February Watch 22nd that. Um, we're playing with a few friends as well our, our friends band Decades um, so that's going to be a super fun show and then uh, for Valentine's Day for all you sassy singles and hot couples ding, who ding, ding. Do, <laughs> yeah, um, I'm doing a solo show at um, uh, Angel City Brewery with Keep It Breast okay. and uh, it's going to be fun totally and wasted. totally yeah. I'll, I'll be there <laughs> I'll so, be the drunk white girl in the back beer, music, <laughs> art um, yeah, it, totally good cause. <laughs> Perfect. Totally kissing booth. No, I have no idea. <laughs> this sounds exciting. <laughs> yeah, I just made that up. Um, I'll be playing love songs only. Oh, Aww. <laughs> <Eye roll. laughs> it's okay. We like it. So I don't know if you guys know, there's this band called Diamonds Under Fire. They have this song I'm obsessed with called Binge Thinking. What's the one topic that gets you into binge thinking? I think I binge think over, uh, the way people think. Okay. Yeah, the, what causes people to do certain things or be how they are, create what they create, live how they live. That's good. What about you? Uh, the bees. The bees? Yeah, that the bees are dying. Oh. All the bees are dying. They are? I had no idea. Do you not know about this? No. I'm like, okay, so it's a lot to get into. Yeah. You guys, yeah, the, the world over the bee oh, population. No, I heard yeah, that at the, all. the bee. I love honey. Well, Drink, Shit. drink it in. The oh yeah, all the all the bees are dying. It's like a real, it's oh a huge God. problem, and could signal like global collapse of, you know, everything. Everything. Yeah. yeah. See, and now you're doing it. Now I'm like now you're out. like holy oh my God. shit. I gotta look the this up. And if, yeah. See, so it's uh, yeah. 
Okay. Is sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, I didn't have a downer. You're, such a, yeah. you're yeah. so yeah. you're yeah. so yeah. nice. Right, give me that. Okay. What about you? Anything Jeez. a little happier? <laughs> oh, um, I binge think about romantic relationships. There we go. Mm. What about you? I probably binge think about Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> That's yeah. about it. I'm like, love yes. Her. <laughs> there we go. I know. I love her. So when does the album come out? Do we have a release date? It's uh. We don't have a release date uh, quite yet, but it's it's set for spring. Okay. Um, probably late spring. So. Awesome. Yeah. Well, everybody, be sure to check it out, and you can find it on DaftStar.com as well. Thanks for coming yeah. in today, guys. Thanks for having us. This was Diamonds Under Fire, and you're watching Daft Star. Hi, we're Diamonds Under Fire, and this song is called "Everything Fades to Red." Daft Star.